Hey everyone, um, I'm making this video to announce that I have found a uh, potentially game-breaking bug in, uh, I guess you could, you could call it an exploit, in uh, our beloved Gwent game, Gwent the Witcher card game by uh, CDPR. Um, it is not as much a game-breaking exploit as that it actually crashes the game, uh, more that you can um, obtain an advantage that as soon as this gets out, everybody will try to take advantage of. Uh, it works both in ranked and casual. Uh, I'll just show it in casual here. Um, you need to use Bran to, to use the, the exploit. Um, I found this when I was running the exact list I just uh, started playing now. It's actually a pretty cool Kambi deck that I played to 4.1k even you know, before I found the exploit, but that's a different video, right? Me! Or me. So I was playing the uh, the Kambi deck on stream, and one of my viewers with a very sensitive uh, eye and memory, I suppose. Um, we just keep everything here for the purpose of the video. We don't play for winning the, the, the game now, just to show the exploit. So what the exploit actually entails, right? This is the meat of the video. The exploit is that Bran can, doesn't shuffle anymore. So let me actually write this down. We go for... Um, one second. I have to talk and like make the video at the same time now, so I'm afraid I'm not going to remember. It's going to be Scorch, Frost, Raider, Lambert, and Lacerate. Okay, so we take the first three here, meaning uh, this will be the exact order in which we draw cards, right? Now, this used to be a thing. Um, a couple patches ago, maybe three or two ago, people also found this out, but then in uh, more recent patches it was taken out, because of course this gives you quite an unfair advantage in the game, if you know what your draws are going to be. Um, especially in the Canby game it works out quite well, but again that's a different video. Um, so we pass here, and the cards we will draw are Scorch and Frost, and then if we mulligan something we find the Raider. So here we go, once more Scorch, Frost, and Raider. <clears throat> so, Scorch and Frost first, in that order. There you go. And now we mulligan something and we will find uh, Raider. And now we use Ermion, who also doesn't shuffle. We confirmed this in testing. I've been trying this uh, a bunch. Um, if we use Ermion here, we find Lambert and Lacerate. I can help you if you wish. And that's the bug. That's the exploit. Um, I mean, it is only available to Skellige. If I can believe people in my stream, uh, you might have heard of Bane before or uh, Red Mage Man. I think it was Bane who tried in uh, Nilfgaard to do this with uh, Zartithius. Uh, one of my other um, viewers tried it with Francesca in uh, Scoyotel. Uh, but those didn't seem to work. It seems to be a uh, thing tied to Skellige. Oh, I didn't play the card yet. Hang on. It seems to be a thing tied to Skellige, so something like uh, Skellige Bears, which is already extremely powerful. Uh, could become easily game-breaking, as in everybody starts to play that and they will not only have a very powerful deck to begin with, they will also know all the the, the draws they will get. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. Um, I try this in casual, I try this in ranked, it works in both places, and uh, with 100% consistency. I'm not exactly sure I can't say I can't guarantee for a hundred percent that I figured out the uh, blacklisting mechanic, um, but thinning-wise, it's a hundred percent consistent. If you see the order and you write it down, um, they always come out in that order. If you pull a frost with like in this deck, if you hang on, let me move my camera. Um, this deck runs uh, herbalist to find, for instance, frost. So if your top two cards are uh, frost, like y you play Bran, you look at the deck and you find the top two cards are Frost, uh, and you thin them out with Herbalist, then it just goes to the third card, 
which you will also be able to see with Bran. So you can manipulate your own draws. Uh, you will know when you have to push and bleed to be able to find win conditions. Uh, or not, because your win conditions are all the way at the bottom of the deck and you will never find them, or they are at, you know, slightly top of your deck, like close enough to find in mulligans. So, <clears throat> with that, um, easy 5k MMR, I guess, right?